M0 FXB, big thanks to Hiroshi for sending me the settings on the Kenwood D75 to work with the HD SDR software that you're seeing in the background. I'll read some of the notes. Please note that the THD75 does not output an IQ signal instead. It provides an IF signal centered at 12 kHz with a bandwidth of 15 kHz. Therefore, signals beyond this bandwidth cannot be observed. So the settings are in the D75, presuming that you've already done a factory reset and set back to defaults on the radio and the software. Go to single mode first. If you press the F, then B, that will be, let's come out of this. Let me just come out of IF mode a second. So you'll see now we're in dual receive. Press the F, then the A, B, and that gets, into, gets you into single receive, but you want to be on the B band. When you're on the B band, you can actually type your different frequencies by pressing the enter button. So enter, we'll go 014255 enter so that's how you get your your frequencies for the hf bands and to change the mode you press the mode button if you look up here it says lsb usb so we'll leave it on upper side band 20 meters now type menu then one zero two and see it says a af here just go down one to if okay and then exit by pressing menu. So you're now in IF mode. We've got our cable plugged into the radio and going into the PC. And you know, get yourself a data cable. Then type menu 104. And you want to select antenna connector because I don't think that using the internal antenna is going to be very good on, on the HF band. So antenna connector and select and then just go menu so you're now receiving and sending your signals to the software all i changed in the software is go to options f7 here options so just click options here and then at the top go down until you see input channel mode for RX and I just chose the left okay you could use the right but I chose the left okay left channel only and that's all I've done there and then now just here and I accidentally changed this but you just want to set these here to 12 on the see it says tune here set that to 12 there you go 12 okay see that there and then just zero these off you can zero them by right clicking and left clicking your mouse and then these are turned off because you can't control the there's no cat control there's no serial control you can't control the frequency or display the frequency you are literally just using the if to get the the sort of full screen waterfall that you're seeing now so unfortunately the conditions are a bit quiet um i will i'll turn up the volume and I will try this when it's busy. And then you are tuning on your on your radio. There's someone there. To go fine tune, I would press F, then star. And that gives you more fine tuning you can still hear on the radio as well but i am hearing on my pc speaker someone there playing music but is that music i think it is F star. So give that a go. Now the other thing is to take note of your settings here. So you've got your waterfall spectrum, your RBW 11.7 here, averaging, and then your speed here. 
we've got a speed. Same goes down here as well. Find the setting that you like. Measure averaging there. See what works for you. You've got zoom and speed. And just adjust it until I can hear the audio coming now. There's a very weak station there. He is very weak. So when it's when the bands are busier, I'll come back and I'll I'll do this again, see if we can get some nice signals. Hope this helps. Massive thanks to Hiroshi. Thank you very much. Bye for now, all the best.